Hey guys, how you doing? This is Steve from Craze TV. Just wanted to do a review on Corel Video Studio X10. And I get a lot of questions about on some of my videos that I put out uh, what screen capture device I use and what video software do I use on my videos. And all my videos are done with Corel. I've used it ever since X2. And I love this software. It's easy. There's a lot you can do with it. And it doesn't cost a lot of money at all. It's very it's probably the most affordable software out there for video editing. So in in Video Studio X10, this is just coming out now. There's a few new features that I want to point out. Uh, here's what what the new features are uh, you got uh, slideshow showcase slideshow template um, multi-point motion tracking uh, working with portrait videos adding music to your videos uh, I don't know what this is every great movie has a great soundtrack I don't know what makes your music fade in and out and automatically trim to fit the length of the video uh, contemporary white slide slideshow template. That's cool. Um, let's see what else do we got? Uh, tutorials. Get more. Just got this upgrade software from Nine, and I love Nine. Uh, they finally added the multi-camera function so there's a lot of add-ons you can get with this uh, software but one of the biggest things that I wanted to show you when I'm doing this little review video and uh, overview is the fact that Corel comes with its own live screen capture so you could pay hundreds of dollars for you know those other screen capture software ah, i forget what the names of them but uh, a lot of youtubers use them or whatnot or you could just buy this whole software and be able to edit all your videos you can eat, you can do stop motion you can do all these different things with corel video studio and on top of that, get a live screen capture. It's awesome. I mean, I'm using it with a blue USB mic. And um, all my little review videos that I do are done with this screen capture. So I really recommend this software. And since 10's coming out, I would get 10. You could get nine probably at a discounted price, but I don't, I don't know. I would get, uh, I'd go ahead and get 10. I haven't messed with it much yet, uh, but it's similar. If you've messed with Corel, it's it's real similar. I don't know how much is different. Well, Mass Creator, I don't know. That's different. I didn't see that in the last one, but th this is awesome. This came out in nine, and this is uh, the multi-camera editor. Um, so let's see. So basically, you know, like if you're doing a music video, you can have different uh, multi-camera camera angles, and they're really easy to edit. And here's where you get your like like your tracks uh, so the overlay tracks you can have up to 20 title tracks there's two title tracks voice tracks oh wait, maybe I got a here's uh, music tracks can have it up to eight so it's a real easy easy software let me let 
let me drag something in here real quick to show you guys like this is cool um you can go here to speed and time lapse you just slow it down that easy um there's freeze frame let's see 360 video that's new i don't think that was in the last one uh you can make 3d i haven't made 3d videos yet but um that would be cool so here's fx they got some new looks like they got some new oh cool okay new boris fx titler good do you want to change the project settings to match your video properties uh, no this is a video i'll be working on here just a review video on these awesome earplugs now here's the audio filter which you got tons of different effects amplify clicks removal echo long echo these are new new blue auto mute new blue cleaner hum remover oh that's cool uh some of these other ones they've they've been in before you know like the normalize and stuff like that volume lever and reverb So if you click on reverb and you add it, you can come here in options and adjust what you want. So it's really cool. Hey guys, what's up? This is Steve. Hey, I got a review for you. So there's a lot you can do with this. And then when you go to video, you can, you can uh, do a lot of different things in here also. Um, these are color patterns. What I like to do is go here and then you get, get your solid colors like black and, and white and whatever. This is your titler. And you can really uh, do some. Because they've had some of these titles in here since the beginning. But you can really adjust whatever. And... Uh, if you really want to get deep into it, you can go into the uh, Boris FX and create some really cool titles. But I got to activate that, I guess, to, to get that to work right now. So, uh, A and B, this is your, um, these are your just, you know, you got your crossfades. These are your transitions where you can, you know, like say, uh, there's your, there's your, scissors say i cut these two two things here and um you just slide these in between the film between the cuts of the film i haven't tried it. these other sizes yet but uh but as far as these size this uh, size goes it, you know trans it does the the little um you know transition but you can go in there and customize it and really get a little more in depth with it so let's see like uh start Are these other sizes yet but as far as these size this size goes it and that's not a great example but you can just <clears throat> so the fx is right there if you double click on there on the FX, there's the, well, that's video tuner, tune up. That's what we had before. Um, you can exit that, take it out if you don't want it. But as far as the trans, transitions, I'm trying to, let's try this one. I'm trying to get it good. Other exam. sizes yet? But so, as far as these si this size goes, it fit. It's okay. 
When it renders, it looks a lot better. I think I got it. Let me just go to crossfade because that is one everybody uses. Uh, if you want to, if you want to shrink the track, you just pull it here, or if you want to extend it, extend it all the way here, and then double click. We can uh, customize it from here. I'll add to my favorites. And what you can do is you can actually drag it and make it longer, so the crossfade is, is, is much but as longer. As far as these si this size goes, see how it. What I might want to do is drag this, shorten it down. It's crazy. So anyway, here's the case. Okay. So let's get closer to the crossfade so I can show you guys sizes yet but as far as these size this size goes it fit perfect okay so I think you get the gist of it it's very easy to do just drag down into your you know cut parts of the video your slices whatever uh, this is auto music they've got some music that's royalty free here that you can use for your videos really cool um, it, it looks like they've added uh, a bunch bunch of stuff here ambient epic electronica yeah so they got a lot a lot more music that's cool these are cool these are little templates beginning of like a video like say you're doing a wedding or whatever video you got these beginning templates you got middle endings complete so there's a lot of easy quick videos like vacations and stuff that you can create really quick instant projects general uh, graffiti HTML5 but anyway Aside from that, click on the link in the video description. It'll take you right to the uh, website where you can get this software at the best price. I really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this video. Thank you very much. Please subscribe to the channel, and uh, I will talk to you guys soon.